Hi there and welcome in this uh, getting started for my new tools, it's Burnout Tools. First of all we can need to open Houdini and we can need to create a Geo because these uh, tools it's working inside a Geo network, it's not the object uh, context but it's the SOP context. context. So we can need to create the MM, we can find Burnout and give me one second okay and burnout it's created for us here we can find we can create more room okay we can find more setting and more tabs the tabs it's here the base geometry with here with the input all needed for the input the range meter and the velocity that the temp cache it's the system for create the temporary cache about for your emitter for geometry meter now we can see what's i mean for geometry meter here the pyro setting pyro setting you can find the tab about the meter with all setting for a meter for create the voxel and here the attribute you should use it inside uh, your emitter and for now it's the only density temperature and the fuel here the noise you can apply the noise on the emitter and you can also here create the temporary cache for your emitter in the top tab you can find all setting about uh, the um, simulation so how to uh, set up your simulation the sub step where is the frame it's started in this case my timeline is different so i can put here the position it's your the banding box where is created your band in your container so we can see that here the division sites here if your boundaries is closed or open here you can add the rest field and when you are enabled you can apply here the division of your rest field here the simulation section here the basic simulation and here the combustion because if you enable for example the, the meter the fuel add the fuel you can also have the combustion here and you can should enable the combustion and then you can uh, set in your elements okay and here the shape you can apply the shape from your simulation like the dissipation the tool disturbance shading sharpers turbulence and confirm you can choose that like this is very similar to the pyro solver Collision tab, you can uh, apply the collision element for create the collision, the interaction with the smoke. Volume visualization here, you can uh, visualization your density. And here the cache system for save your simulation. You can create your simulation and save in a BGO format or you can use the OpenVDB and export the VDB and create, for example, the VDB for load inside another software like, uh, for example, Blender, Maya, 3DX Max, Sima 4D, or another system is enabled for read the OpenVDB cache. That is all for, for now for this uh, software. You can find also the documentation. Inside documentation, you can find all parameters and I describe all parameters it's very nice also you can find the section is uh, about uh, the uh, the note uh, the improvement uh, the bug uh, and, uh, and etc etc for now these tools is doesn't work with uh, the sparse but uh, you can find uh, some uh, nice tips for uh, uh, use the sparse system for example you can use this output this output is this is uh, output uh, of my effects that is for my geometry okay you can use that for create the geometry the part where is uh, uh, you can uh, use uh, the the pyro this is the pyro emitter so you can use that 
output you can create your cache that output and you can use that for example in combination with sparse if you want or uh, more simple more easy you can for example here in the, in the meter tab you have the cache and from the cache you can save that cache and then you can load the cache from another system if you want more important more of this for example the quickly path but it's the same tools and preset really it's a preset I did in the past you can find online the very simple video and on my youtube channel and then you can find also the link for download that for free the same it's for example for the abc loader you can see then what's uh, it's the abc loader script it's the script for load and for create immediately some nodes some sops and for create uh, for example your uh, collision is better if you don't use the shelf you can use that for example so we can start to see how is uh, working how is uh, use that tools in the next video